Right, hello everybody, welcome to game number 14. Flings versus, oh no. Toes of Valhalla will fuck you, whoever sniped me. Oh no, it's Joe's toes, alright. It's maybe not a snipe, because the guy's coach name is Joe's toes. So it might not even be a fucking piss-taking snipe. I'm gonna find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their Togoroth. <laughs> wow, he's got a dirty player, he's got two ad jobs. Oh, fuck me. This is depressing, isn't it? He doesn't even need the chef, does he? Like, the chef doesn't even do anything, he doesn't need rerolls. Oh, man. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, God. Even worse, Tom Schniz. Movement 6, armor 11 dwarves. Oh, <laughs> movement, movement 6, armor 11 dwarves, the worst kind of dwarves. Right, try to dice him. Jaws tours. <laughs> Ah, it doesn't even sound like a dicing art. <laughs> that just sounds like a normal game of Blood Bowl. A completely normal game of Blood Bowl, that. <laughs> That's not even an interesting game. Right, so he 3Ds, he 3Ds, he 2Ds. Foul. Win. The end. <laughs> hey, Jimmy, hey, chat. All right. Oh man. <laughs> Fun facts. Oh no. So, Alright, five rerolls now. Really get to uh really get to go crazy with the uh, greed and stuff. Alright, so you got instant uh instant bloody grabbing, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> Don't even try to pick up the ball. That seems good. Fuck him up. Shithead Norse. Cannot. 
brilliant. Ah bon, ça Où va le monde si les arbitres se mettent à faire leur travail So much for the high roll. See, this is what happens, right? I try to high roll someone, this happens. Everyone else. <laughs> Everyone else. Woo! I just foul this guy. He's dead. Look at Ducky. Foul, dead. Foul, dead. Woo! Me. Fuck off. <laughs> Yeah, there was a removal, yeah. <laughs> there sure was a removal. Ugh, yuck. Ooh, tree, tree dinner now. No, of course he gets a power on the first hit. Why wouldn't he? Why wouldn't he? I know it's three dice, but he could have got a push, couldn't he? And then he'd have been, then he would have been in, in getting smashed by a tree. Everyone who plays Norse in real life, right, they just one, two, beat three, four, them to within five, an inch of their fucking life. Get there. All right, these armor 11 dwarves. Tough to beat. Try to be positive. <laughs> it's not over yet. The trees are in some kind of formation together. He's got three guys on the tree, which is nice, isn't it? But uh, it's just roughing it. The fact that they've got so much block. That's the problem. The problem is they've got so much block. They can just put down your flings a lot. And obviously if I'd just got, like, you know, on another day, I could have got three removals on the LOS. And then uh, it could have uh, snowballed either way. But not to be. I really wanted to blitz off with a block one. Because he's one of the few non-block guys and would have, you know, would have been great. But I just, by doing that way, I didn't have to activate him, did I? So it was saved, saved a 2 plus 
Molding toy. It's fucking taking the piss in it, Tours of Valhalla. Oh yeah, these are all 50, 55 percent as now. It's gonna be painful. It's gonna be painful. The old, uh, the old Norsing is gonna be painful. Oh yeah, now he doesn't get the knockdown even with blood. We might be able to score this half. Yeah, well, he's got Norse. <laughs> he's got Norse. This is rough, isn't it? Like, this is just... It's just really difficult now. Yeah, <laughs> what are the chances that <laughs> it's not a piss take? <laughs> Unbelievable. Got a removal. That's a little too soon. No. <laughs> no, um, what's wrong with my feet is I've got ingrowing toenails on, well, I had ingrowing toenails on my left foot and I got, uh, I got two toenails removed. And my big toenail, I got both hard, like both both sides removed of the nail, and then from that, people said I got my toes removed, which is obviously not true. I got my toenails removed. Um, so there you go. And unfortunately, the uh, the big toe has now grown back. Um, they they like put some stuff on it to stop it growing back, and it hasn't. It's, it hasn't stopped it. It's grown back. So now I need either the whole thing taken off or the side again taken off. And my big toe. So there you go. Yeah, I probably should have my right one done as well. Okay, if I was going to get it done, and then uh, then the uh, the thing happened, didn't it? With the uh, what's it called? Covid and all that happened. So <laughs> yeah, it does. Yeah. <laughs> no, if you imagine a toenail. To be four by three, right? Imagine this is my big toenail, right? Four by three squares. They cut off this side and this side, so it's just left with like a little thin strip in the middle, and then it hasn't grown back on this side, but this side has grown back again. So now it's it's going into my skin again. So there you go. No, oh, no. Powered me. Powder. Go for the lob tutty. Put him under pressure on defense. Oh wow, really school. That's unbelievable. He 
Yeah, how have you not seen that school? All right, you. Well, that's disappointing, isn't it? You mother don't you fucking dare. Good. Right, so now it's hard for him. Actually worked out pretty well, didn't it, by making me the dodges. I'd obviously much rather just scored. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so you can just four plus dodge for two D. He's got no rerolls though. I haven't taken Kaz yet. So this actually isn't going that bad at all, is it? And with a score on turn five, we'll have two rerolls versus his non. And he could fail like ball handling things, could go 2-0 up, there's a chance. <laughs> yeah, reckless of random. Yeah, yeah, yeah sidestep is pretty nice. For sure. But he wants, like, he wants sprint first, doesn't he? Sprint would have also been nice. Yeah, he hasn't failed anything yet. <laughs> oh, no, he didn't. No, no, he didn't. He, he made the 4 plus dodge, didn't he, from this one, and then he got killed by the Blitz. It's amazing how many knockdowns this team has suffered without anybody, like, dying. Only two KOs. Pretty unbelievable. Ah, power of AV6, exactly. Oh... Tours of Valhalla. It's fucking unreal, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's unlikely for him to fail ball handling stuff, isn't it? He does have two edge four guys. So not that much chance of him failing ball handling stuff with no rerolls, but hey. I don't, you can base the ball, I don't give a shit. <laughs> Thanks, Kill. Yeah, it was, it was a real stupid game. <laughs> the funnier part was me just like saying, I hope I don't get diced, I hope I don't get diced, and then got absolutely diced. Harder than I've ever been diced in my life. Right, do I don't want to do a three D, do I? Um, I like I don't want to do a two D. Ah, but then I've got a high roll to win. So I guess I'll do Le combat est très déséquilibré, Bob. Eh oui! Son adversaire va se faire atomiser! J'en suis tout émoustillé! There's only two. I could have gone for a rusty play instead of a low one, but never mind. Oh, fuck off. Oh, come off it, man. Of course, I could have sidestepped here so that he couldn't have based the ball, but it's a 1 in 36, so I think it's not worth getting my sidestep a hit to stop a 1 in 36, but obviously it was. This was the one time out of 36 that it was worth getting him hit by fucking block and frenzy three dice. Fuck off, man. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> 
You really need to not have that happen, don't you, as halflings? I guess I've got to pick people up and move them and stuff, but I'll just go. Yeah, like I think it was the right decision. Like I, 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 I do think it was the right decision. It's just fucking annoying, isn't it? That's the one in thirty-six. That was the one in thirty-six that they fucking got punished on. I guess I should have stood everybody that way. But I just thought I'll score. I just thought I'll score, and if I don't, I've lost. Who gives a shit? But that's a stupid way to think, isn't it? Should have done all the safe moves first. Nah, you can you can just pick up. There you go, get the extra hit this time. And he gets removed. <laughs> so at least he didn't have the... Oh, he didn't have it anyway, did he? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... Nah, I could have had extra tackles on him as well. Could foul him. You could also just not fail anything over here. Good. Fuck you. <laughs> Asshole Norse. Don't even dream of Apple in this. Bastard. Level. Woo! Yeah, I guess I should have sized up the other one. I don't know, man. I really didn't want to give him three dice of block just to stop. Like he had to roll a two plus to base the ball, and it was and it was only making me roll a one in thirty six. And if he hits me with block, he's really got a good chance of casting the guy, hasn't he? So basically, a sure knockdown if he hits him. Six dice with frenzy, so he's basically guaranteed getting the knockdown. And then he's got a real good chance to break AV and, and cause a perm or whatever. Well, not a perm, just like a removal. I didn't think it was worth the chance. Yeah. Yeah, I think it was the right thing. Just never fucking. Yeah. Got this edge four scoring through, hasn't he? That's hard to deal with. And this one Wanker. 
No, oh, I guess I could have blitzed him with a tree, couldn't I? Shit. <laughs> All right, there's a chance. There's a chance. <laughs> there's a chance. I thought it was going to be a skull for sure after re rolling the GFI. <laughs> what did you miss? There was a lovely toss. It was a lovely fling toss. But I mean, it, the problem is it's easy for him to, you know, knock him down and everything. Oh, he's going for the jump up. It's failed. Alright, now it gets a bit trickier then. I think he should have just blitzed, right? He's got frenzy, he should have just blitzed. He probably, maybe he tried to and just like... What I, what I do with jump up players is, I think I'll blitz with this guy and then just do the jump up block. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, why doesn't it, why doesn't the control, <laughs> why doesn't the UI read my mind? <laughs> this is rubbish. <laughs> Who was that fling? Satatord, legend. Unconcerned elf got tossed off by Pepper, which was nice. Il faut qu'il se débarrasse du ballon. La zone d'embut est en vue. Doesn't get him 3D. Let's Not a removal. They've stayed on. Like, to be fair, the flings have stayed on the field unbelievably well. So with that in mind, I probably should have taken that extra hit. Not failing anything. Sadly. Hey, well, there you go. I lied. I lied. <laughs> <laughs> well, he failed that in the best possible way, didn't he? Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Should have maybe thrown it at him. He's a scoring threat, isn't it? I could tag the scoring threat. Let's go for the uphill. I could go for the uphill on him to push him to like here and then go for a 1D. Alright, tag him. C'est toujours risqué de tout donner pour piquer un sprint. Ah, 
<laughs> that was the safest thing to do, wasn't it? Right, the uphill's failing there, isn't it? So <laughs> trip and fall over. Yeah, I, should, I guess looking at the situation, maybe I should have taken an extra hit. I really didn't want it for one in 36. <laughs> Fucking easy, this, isn't it? Fucking three twos to score. Or a three two. And it's fucking easy, isn't it? It's not even. It's not even hard. It's not heartbreaking because I've already accepted he's just definitely going to do it. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it was 50 50 ish, wasn't it? It was about 50 50 to do with 3 2 pluses, but I just, just thought he's fucking done it, hasn't he? Oh, wow. Totally should have taken the extra hit now. Ooh, two are gone again. So he's got zero rerolls. He's got nine players now. He stayed out. This is pretty lucky, actually, isn't it? Apart from failing the one in thirty-six to score. <laughs> Apart from failing that, it's been it was a lucky half. It, it was genuinely a lucky half. Apart from the one in thirty-six to score. And so far, so we've just got to put that out of the head now. He's, you know, the second half, he's only got nine players. He's got no re-rolls. Anything can go wrong. Even two dice blocks can go wrong for him, can't they? With, uh, with block can still go wrong. So there's a chance. Should not have gone for the GFI. I know it's better to swim, isn't it? It's better. You're th about 30% are all a, a one on two dice. Whereas you're thirty three percent to fail the throw. So like I mean you could argue that you your player can't die by doing the GFI. But that that's all it's not. It's more likely to score you're more likely to score by making the GFI. But yeah, your player can't die on the pass. So Yeah. So this isn't terrible. Can be positive again now. Uh, it's my go-to defensive setup kill with uh, sidesteppers, two sidesteppers for the sidelines, and then the edge four ready to be tossed off. Um, if you want to be part of obviously, team positive, it's very then, weak uh, to quick snap. It's shockingly weak better, to quick okay? snap, but um, it's really good against a misfield or a blitz. Unless they put someone in front of the tree, but it means they've got to put someone in front of the tree. I want to find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. I guess I could like go tree, tree, fling. That would be better on a blitz. Like it's not great on blitz. Could be. It could be if they, uh, if they, if they just completely didn't bother with the allies. But it doesn't make any sense for it to be going blitz, does it? Actually, thinking about it. Yeah, hopefully he goes for a surf here. He's just basing people. This is the problem, right? They just base people and they've all got block. So it's like... It's bad news. Bad news for your halflings. No, it's powered. We might take the push. Take the push, go for the surf. Shit. <laughs> Ha! 
Ces joueurs sont tout proches. Le combat paraît inévitable. with going for the ball here is the surf, isn't it, if it fails. See what happens anyway. Isn't it saves 30k? <laughs> right. It was all right, wasn't it? Ooh, il ne fait pas bon se retrouver là. Oh, so you can GFI to tag him. He could dodge GFI. He could double dodge GFI. Okay, we'll go for him. Not bad though, not bad. Not bad. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing, he was already in a decent spot, wasn't he? I don't know why I thought it'd be better up there. Because he was already, yeah, he was already making the cage there easily. It was alright, wasn't it? Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have activated the tree without the reroll for the root. The good thing is he's like, he's, he's rooted in a good square, isn't he? Because you've only got to get to midfield. The flings haven't you to be in throwing range. <laughs> it was a funny throw on it, it was fucking dead. Did his job though, didn't he? He did his job. He, it was a great it was a genuinely great throw, because who cares if the halfling dies? <laughs> uh, no, they're just they're just they're just camouflaged next to each other. Pedro. Yeah, yeah, that would have been glorious, wouldn't it? Would you go pro on a tree? I guess, yeah, block pro, right? Block pro. you got to go block first. But pro would be pretty good, because they want to punch each They want to punch things a lot, don't they? They want to activate a lot, and they want to punch a lot. Pretty good, nearly getting the ball in a, in a cage. <laughs> <laughs> It's all right. Had worse turns. Jump up, yeah. Jump up would be good. Would it's good for elves? Not so well. Just mm. so like that would be the choice for elves forever. But in Blood Bowl 2016 or Blood Bowl 3, the jump up isn't required because you get timber. But yeah, the, the standing up is very good. Um, you could fail this, yeah, good. 
Head off my pitch, prick. <laughs> Just don't catch it on the dirty player. Or the elf. Okay. That's not terrible, I guess. Should have stood this guy up first, shouldn't I? been a few successful GFRs, haven't they? Right, so now... Oh, this is three dodges. Not so much, two. It's none. Maybe I should have just gone for the edge four to assist there. Would have been three for him. And then he could have punched, then he could have gone for recovery. Yeah, I was going to hit the old one too. He was going to do two dodges if he could. I think after filling the first one, then I would have gone for him and just hit him. I don't know. Obviously, you really want to make the two dodges and then 2D him. And then... He could have had the ball over here or something. I don't know. It's not wasn't easy. It actually wasn't easy to get the ball safe, was it? Plus strength and a tree got a point. So yeah, the problem is you would all, you would want block and pro first and probably jump up. I don't like nerves of steel, but block, pro, jump up. Not a fan of nerves of steel. Oh my god, unconcerned elf asking the questions. Yeah. About to get smashed to pieces. <laughs> Is your answer? <laughs> no, that's true, that's true, Grimms. This this block though this was one the, the reason of maybe I should have gone with him first was to not get hit right that was the thing maybe I should have just gone for the three plus pick up but then again I didn't want to reroll I could have rerolled it though I guess oh I could have gone to the sideline and then sidestep away couldn't I and then and then like you know if he's very could have, yeah, I could have surfed him. Oh, that was a bit of a butt fuck up number. Yeah, plus movement, yeah. But again, less so in. Uh, again, the, the movement's actually more important for moving, isn't it, for halflings? Like, halflings like to move the trees because they're the only good players. So. <laughs> Halflings getting moved on the trees is nice for just moving them, but they w they won't need it. They won't need it um, when they get timber. Standing up won't be a problem for them, which is good. I say it won't be a problem. You can still roll one or whatever. But a lot less, of, much less of a problem for them. Oh, 
terreur ramasser ce ballon tout de suite Tree on the ball though. Love the old tree on the balls. I think he just goes to the pickup. <sighs> Yuck. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it's, it's often going to be a two plus, and like, well, I mean, often a three plus. So it's going to be, yeah, four, three, or two. <laughs> oh, Rick, it's unbelievable, isn't it? <laughs> Literally, Jaws Tours is the coach name and Tours of Valhalla is the team name. <laughs> Looks like a fucking piss take, doesn't it? <laughs> unbelievable. Oh, Rick. <laughs> Absolutely unbelievable. Disgusting. Yes, to swim without calling it that. Yeah, it's stupid that it's it's like literally exactly the opposite of what it does. Yeah, he's gonna hit the fucking edge four. He's got no choice because it clears the tackle zone. Ugh. Maybe I shouldn't have gone for the pick up. Maybe I should have gone for the one deep block. Okay, he's not dead. But he pushes into here, doesn't he? And he just picks up and runs away. Two two. He could fail. Thirty percent shot. There's a chance. There's a chance he fails. Okay, Sean is dead. No, only badly hurt. Ooh. Could fail this. No. Really running out of players. Oh, I thought he'd hit him. Still good though, obviously. <laughs> Still pretty good. Oh, 
You need a bit of fucking dice as halflings, don't you? Oh well. <laughs> this could have been a win, couldn't it? This could have been a win. That one in 36 dodge. <sighs> it felt like the right move. Not getting punched for a one in 36, but. Yeah, to be fair, but then if he doesn't score here, he's got no rerolls, right? So I could still, could still um, stop him scoring. I imagine all. I mean, they've they brought out the Black Orc thing, haven't they? So maybe it is coming out in August. Maybe it genuinely is coming out in August. Who knows? Maybe everyone knows except me, but I I don't know. <laughs> everyone else could have like could have signed NDAs, and ev literally every everybody but me could know. But I have got no fucking clue. So there you go. Yeah, he could be punished for not destroying him. Could roll a 1 on this dodge, couldn't he? That's the thing. But he can also just run away. And he could roll a 1 and not score. <laughs> yeah, dude. That's the thing, isn't it? You're not allowed to if you've got one, so... If people aren't just, you know, breaking the law like some people did in other things. Um... No, wasn't gonna roll a one. Right. <laughs> there you go. GG. Yeah. I mean, there's a chance of the, of the score and a draw, isn't it? There's a chance of a draw. Should have been a win though, I think. I've 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 signed I've I have signed an NDA once. And I I, I didn't break it. Unbelievable eh? Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Flipping Norse. Flipping Norse. Oh, flip me, guys. Thank you very much, Rick, for staying fantastic for over three glorious beaver pregnancies. And, uh, yeah, congratulations again if you... Obviously, as I said before, but... If you didn't already see it, congratulations, Rick. And glorious, uh, glorious domination of CCL playoffs. <laughs> For the JFW. <laughs> Incredible, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, this is this seems quite good here. Right, well, then we can't get something here. If you go here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Maybe it's two in. I don't know where you meant to stand for here, actually. I really don't know where you're supposed to stand. I guess I don't have to go for the toss, do I?
C'est un super match jusque là. Le rythme s'est un peu ralenti et ça va reprendre de plus belle d'une seconde à l'autre. Deux gros balours qui s'allient pour vous tomber dessus. Ça peut faire très mal. Et bim Go for the kills. Among us super league. I just think and feel this pickup's pretty bad, isn't it? I thought I was totally should have put this guy in front, that was terrible. That was genuinely terrible. That was just awful. Just, just lazy, you know? These could have screened it. These could have come up and screened it. And I could have moved this guy over, and like everything could have been good. That was really, really terrible. Okay, just go for the uh. Go up to main, go for the win with no rewards. Oh, shit. Maybe I, just, maybe I shouldn't have done all that. that. That pissed me off. I should have just played properly. I should have played properly there, shouldn't I? I? I don't know, I just went off. I just literally just stopped caring and threw the game away. Could have maybe he's got to draw that game. Yeah, that's tilt to swim. That's tilt. That there is tilt. And I don't even know why it happened. I just randomly did it. Just randomly pissed the game away for no reason. I just don't know. <laughs> no idea. No, tilt has got nothing to do with how angry you are, Dimmy. It's uh, it's about playing badly. And that was terrible. That was just genuinely awful. I don't know why it happened. I had four turns. I could have just gone back, picked it up with him. And, you know, kept it safe. And then thrown the ball and scored. And uh, made it a 1-1 draw. Pretty easily, pretty easy 1-1 one, one draw there. Throwing it away for no reason. So weird. <laughs> I've got no idea why I did something so terrible. <laughs> no idea why I did that. The worst thing was, well, I had to stick in the reroll, didn't I? So, like, I couldn't even change my way out of it at that point. Hello, Frosty. Glorious. No, I won't give me until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. How many beaver pregnancies are we on now? Nearly nine, well, over eight and a half. Thank you, Backyard Dodo. Nearly three years. Unbelievable, thank you very much. Absolutely fucking glorious. I don't know what that was about. That was hide hideously bad. <laughs> oh well. Go for the six plus. I mean, that's really stupid. There's no need to be that many. Is there? Situation que j'adore. 
Grosse pression sur le porteur du ballon. Il a intérêt à s'activer. <laughs> That's the most blood bowl thing ever, isn't it? It's like it just happens every time. Make all the rolls until the fucking last one. And I know because the turnover or the last roll, the last roll is always the last one. But you know what I mean? Like you just like, oh yeah, I'll just make a million dodges and GFIs. Get the hit on the ball. Fucked. <laughs> Yeah, I'd say I'm gonna be dinner soon. I don't know why I did that though. What the fuck, man? If it wasn't the halflings, I'd probably just concede now because I wouldn't know what the fuck I did that turn. That was so weird. The game was fine, wasn't it, really? It was just that turn. It was just that turn. Then why the fuck did I go for the completely unprotected pickup into one turn attempt? <laughs> like, it was just mental. I guess I was unlucky with the one in 36 dodge as well, wasn't I? And he's had no rerolls the entire match. <laughs> Has hardly failed a thing. But he's not, so he's got block on every block anyway, hasn't he? So he's unlike, and he's got the two edge four were actually crucial for him because it meant that he was wasn't really gonna fail. Uh, wasn't really gonna fail any any of the ball stuff, was he? Actually, he he failed his two three two pluses at the end as well, so he failed something. Otherwise, could have already been one nil down. <laughs> this way. I was just reading for you. I don't know why I did that. On dirait que le marchand de sable est passé. Faites attention à lui. C'est un escroc de première. Right. Uh oh. Still got a chance. Yep. No. I don't know. I mean, I dropped the GG bomb. But I mean, I hadn't given up at that point. I literally hadn't given up because that was like. I don't know why I did the one turn instead of like a normal drive. I just don't understand. Literally don't understand what what I did there. Terrible, absolutely terrible. Ce joueur à cet attaquant, il transpire la faiblesse. I guess I was, yeah, I guess I was, Steve. I guess I just had a, a, an injection of Rick positivity and thought I'll just I'll just score a one turn and then turn him over because I'll have a reroll and he won't. But if I'd just played sensibly and screened and everything, then I could have failed the pickup and not re-rolled it. And then, you know, gone for another gone for the turn, even the score after. Like it was just horrible because not screening at all made me made me re-roll the pickup, and then obviously you can't win with no re-rolls because you'll occasionally fail something, unlike this guy. Um, so like, I don't know, it's just fucking weird, wasn't it? It's just fucking weird, horrible, terrible. But yeah, I was thinking go for the, you know, hope for a misfield and go for the win, but even that was stupid, right? You should have just gone for the four turn drive. Maybe it's because I'm tired and stuff. I'm often knackered. And maybe that's it, just knackered. Jim knackered.
fuck off, Demi. See, look, the minute that I had to put my guys forward, let's get fucked. Fucking chunter. But you know, th this would work with the hefties, wouldn't it? The hefties could uh, could go back. A hefty could go back and go there and drop it here, and then he could go one, two, three, four, five, six. So hefties with uh, hefties with what's that thing called? Um, fumble ruskies. Hefties with fumble ruski could do could really help the one turn. Just having one one back like this, and his job is to pick up a deep ball and drop it in front of the others. Not terrible. Hello, fiction, yeah. Removed because this scene. Fling. Flings. Charleston, yeah. I don't die. Oh, une passe de dernière minute. Qu'est-ce que ça va donner? C'était un match incroyable. J'ai bien vu que mon cœur allait exploser. Absolutely disgusting. Well. You know, if that one in 36 dodge had worked, and if my brain hadn't fallen out, that could have been a win or a draw, but instead, <laughs> roll the one in 36 and my brain fell out. Brilliant. Record looks trash now, but it's okay, isn't it? Like, I don't care about qualifying. Like, I'd say, and if was I going for 65 and would I take the cup, like, yeah, but it's not. It's not like... I'm playing them to qualify and I'm playing them to get 65 in it. I'm playing them just for the sake of it. So if they qualify, they qualify. And, you know, if they get 65, they get 65. Like, that's the goal, obviously. But it doesn't matter if it fails, does it? Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.